Have you ever wondered who created the buildings that you look at when you're walking down your home, traveling through cities, enjoying vacation through countries, waiting at an airport or a railway station or bus stands? It's an architect and a planner. A person who is the divisor, planner, builder and creator of built environment around us. And the field is known as architecture and planning. profession which allows a person to be on the top of the pyramid of all the professions concerning built environment but how to be an architect or a planner well the answer to this question is you have to join a professional program which makes you a complete architect and planner the one who can work through concept to completion of any built environment So here we are at ASAP Amity School of Architecture and Planning at Amity University Noida a university ranked amongst top 3% universities globally and Asia's only university with the highest US and UK accreditation from WASC and QAA along with the world class infrastructure and other in campus facilities It is also ranked India's number 1 not for profit private university by India Today University Rankings 2019. Amity School of Architecture and Planning, popularly known as ASAP, one of the pioneer institutions in Delhi NCR, ranked in top 5 colleges by India Today in year 2019. The institute boast of intellectual capital enhancement through faculties from diverse backgrounds with a teacher student ratio better than 1 is to 10 the institute offers world class infrastructure like experiential studios smart classrooms with state of art furniture and cutting edge technology paraphernalia digital labs energy and environmental lab material sensitivity and testing lab engineering survey lab timber technology workshop construction yard modeling workshop ultra modern auditoriums among others for grooming our students into professionals 50 to 100% scholarships are provided to the meritorious students for the complete period of their academic tenure At ASAP our aim is to provide quality education to prepare students not only for further study research and for a wide range of career opportunities in industry government and academia but also to become a responsible citizen the school adopts many unique strategies like choice based credit system in the academic curriculum where the students can opt from an array of market relevant electives and interdisciplinary courses to keep up with the rapidly changing world vertical studios in which the students works in the tandem with students of different year and fields collaboration with industry and academic experts architectural competition based live studio projects etc the subsequent environment created through vertical studio allows for more realistic vision framing the thought process and mutual respect for skills by combining students across various years to encourage and enhance team building activities National and international competitions floated in the professional world are undertaken as a part of the course in subjects like architectural design thus updating students about the challenges of the industry and prepare them for the competitive world before by understanding how industry is moving ahead the students at ASAP are always engaged in on-site and hands-on experience in order to understand the various facets of architecture industry visits on-site lectures educational tours construction site visits etc are the part of pedagogy at ASAP One of the major ideology of school is to make digitally literate students by reducing the gap between the on-site experience and academic practices through experiential, hands-on, practical training-based learning using appropriate cutting-edge technology and modern teaching mechanisms rather than theoretical purely classroom-based pedagogy. 
ASAP is one of the few architectural schools in the world to start full-fledged remote collaborative learning during COVID-19 lockdown. It brings ASAP on forefront of knowledge dissimulation in any kind of challenging situations without compromising the quality. Further from this, the school aims the students to succeed professionally and personally with the help of startup atmosphere through our entrepreneurship self, which develop the young generation to be feel ready at the same point of time. They create something different, thus change and transmute values to be responsible citizens. The school believes in the holistic development by challenging students to utilize all level of cognition and to develop physically, intellectually, socially and ethically through involvement in different extracurricular activities in various clubs and committees like cultural club, exhibition club, debate club, photographic club and many more. Special emphasis is given on the physical health of students through participation in outdoor games like cricket, football, basketball, swimming and others. ASAP is dedicated in devising new ways to foster constructive interactions on important intellectual issues among faculty, students and staff within and across institutions. We also promote intellectually rewarding inter-institutionals and inter-university collaborations among faculty. University and institutional level competitions like annual youth fest, Sangatan sports meet, panel design competitions like reflections etc. provide a platform for the students to showcase their talent on a national level. Students are also involved in various philanthropic activities around the years to help the underprivileged and other high-risk behavior groups of the society. These activities are strategically embedded in the pedagogy to contribute towards common social initiative and holistic development of students. ASAP offers five years integrated Bachelor of Architecture (BAC). Two years Master of Architecture (MArch) degree courses approved by the Council of Architecture, four years Bachelor of Planning (B Plan) degree courses, and PhD courses. Our futuristic and dynamic courses are realigned sensibly with the fourth edition Industrial Revolution Education 4.0, as recognized by Christopher Rosser, the era of cyber-physical systems beyond mechanization, mass production, communication, computers, and automation systems. The minimum criteria for admission in BIAC are governed by the norms as given by COA. BIAC journey of students from first year to fifth year. A student spans a lifetime experience at ASAP evolving through two tiers of professional evolution. The first year of sixth semester provide integrated studies of basic of design, building construction, climate responsive architecture, computer application, sustainable development and specialized industry relevant electives such as product design, intelligent buildings, photography, interior design etc. The second tier of four semesters drive the students towards practical application of the theories learned through large-scale design projects, urban development projects, and six-month internship, which append the overall application of various subjects learned. And finally, the students are up and groomed to be industry-ready after the vigorous grounding for five years through an all-encompassing architectural thesis project. This is a glimpse of architectural thesis by one of our student, Mehul Jain, who is in final year. It is submitted this year and is the culmination of all the work of five years. Advancing technology and rapid urbanization has led to resurgence in population growth which aids the transport system to simultaneously expand, improve and innovate. 
India being one of the fastest growing economics invites the proposal of Hyperloop and HSR as a means of travel and the International Finance Service Centre for its commerce. The means of inter- and intra-city movement is a critical element for defining a city's physical, social and economical characteristics. Mass transit systems are vital not only for the smooth functioning of the city but also creating its identity. The thesis aims for research and development of infrastructure of the proposed Hyperloop and HSR transportation hub as a mixed-use development integrating the proposed International Finance Service Centre. The system being at the innovation forefront of transportation demanded a research-oriented design procedure which was the USP of the project. The HSR and Hyperloop line is proposed from Ahmedabad to Mumbai and Mumbai to Pune creating an opportunity for an integrated mixed-use transportation hub starting from the Bandra Kulla complex which is one of the most prominent planned business districts. This diagram represents the Bandra Kulla complex that gives an idea about the context pattern, grain of the masses, surrounding land use and typology of buildings, heights, wind directions, road networks, proposed HSR and Hyperloop line and the proposed site for project. The vision was to create a gateway which not only helps in the smooth functioning of the city but also creates its identity. The design aims to express movement and importance of urban infrastructure through its futuristic architecture, program and scale. The design centers around the expression of pedestrian movement in and around the transportation hub, providing a continuous pedestrian path with brakes at regular interval. The vehicular internal road have been segregated for private and public transport to maintain smooth flow of vehicles and avoiding traffic. The design follows a hierarchy in the planning of spaces that complements the nature and character of the transportation hub. The view of the pedestrian code depicts this nature, scale and edge of the building. The interior space is divided into horizontal and vertical layers creating void inside the mass that is used to guide the movement of people through the building. The section reflects upon the vertical voids and gives an idea of the nature and scale of the space created. The design focuses on the abstraction of transportation hub as a gateway to the city. The void that extends till the main concourse level of the station with changing functions at different level and covered by a super roof system gives an abstraction of people departing and alighting through this gateway. The roof structure extends to create a porch and a separate entrance for the users of the International Finance Service Centre which gives singularity to the entire project. The back approach road makes way for the service entrance of the International Finance Service Centre and the exit for the multi-level car parking avoiding congestion on the main side of the International Finance Service Centre. It also aids for direct entrances to the retail spaces and basement car parking spaces to avoid congestion at the main Bandrakulla complex road. The final design for transportation hub was achieved through iteration of design possibilities. Being one of the most advanced means of transportation, the infrastructure becomes a crucial element in determining and defining the city's physical, social and economical characteristics, responsible not only for the smooth functioning of the city but also creating its identity. The proposal expressed movement through its hierarchy of spaces and creation of vertical and horizontal voids that guides the movement of commuters giving them an essence of alighting or departing through a gateway of the city. MR journey of students from first year to second year. Curated for recent and practicing architecture graduates, the course aims to expose the students to the intricate process of design thinking and research through thoroughly structured courses aligned with the UN Sustainable Development Goals. The first two semester of the coursework focuses on inculcating the professional intent in the students to solve global problems on various facets of sustainable development through studio-based design assignments, research-based seminars, and theory courses on advanced construction technologies, urban morphology, ICT and city planning, 
GIS, artificial intelligence and building energy analysis. The final year is devoted on honoring the student's expertise in developing effective project management skills and the field of architecture as a whole to present themselves as global architecture professionals. It aims at fostering independent thinking and refining the thought process through pre-thesis exploration in third semester, culminating in the thesis work in the final semester. Bachelor of Planning focuses on the challenges of planning and managing the neighborhoods, cities and sustainable communities. The students work on neighborhood, local and regional area planning in the various semesters during their first and second year. The third year of the program comprises the city level planning and infrastructure projects and culminates with a summer internship to enable the students get practical experience of ongoing projects. The fourth and final year further enrich the students with the policies and legislation of planning domain and the experience of working on metropolitan and regional planning exercises in the planning studio with live projects like traffic planning for Noida, duly awarded by the District Administration of Gautam Nagar. The 8th semester allows the student to take an individual thesis project to provide them the opportunity to handle the project in individual capacity and enable them for profession and entrepreneurship. The PhD in Architecture is an interdisciplinary program offered by Amity School of Architecture and Planning. The program provides students with a common core of extensive integrated knowledge focused upon all the facets of architecture and built environment specialization. Admission to PhD programs at ASAP are conducted twice a year for January and July sessions. The program is offered in two modes, full-time and part-time. In last five years, ASAP have successfully placed its students at various sectorial levels. The school boasts of 100% placement in last five years. 41% of total students have joined various reputed companies and firms, thus ensuring maximum consumption of quality learner from ASAP. 36% of students were extended all the help from the institute to pursue their goals of acquiring higher degree from various reputed national and international universities. 23% of students started their own firms as ASAP also believes in nurturing an entrepreneurship attitude in its students. The success of any school is measured by the contribution the alumni are making to the society. Our proud alumni are establishing their niche in the industry through design innovations. Girls leading a change in the society for a better world.
ASAP has always envisioned to see its students being placed at the pinnacle of professional world globally. Hence, the inclusivity of architecture as a course provides wider range of knowledge and augments the possibilities to enter different associated and lateral career fields such as architects, interior designers, city planners, energy consultants, construction project managers, real estate managers, digital designers, product designers, set designers, and many more. ESA prepares students to embrace a commitment to lifelong learning and to become informed, engaged, and productive citizens. An Emitian, always an Emitian.